Okay. So. You guys, are you being shot? No, but you're running away. That's always good. Okay. You guys can pull back to the next line of defence. Oh, I've only got two lines. That's a bit of a shame. Wait, can you get up here? You can't. No, okay, that's good. Can march into there. Nice and slowly, no need to rush. In fact, so can you. Why don't you just come up here? There we go. Our enemy's ladders have reached our walls. It is time for butcher's work. It is unwise to praise the day before sunset, but our men are winning the battle and forging a worthy victory. And they're, they're routing already. Fantastic. It's like fantastic, but added, added the fun. The battle is in our favor. If we remain true and wholehearted, oh, hurry to fudge victory up. will be ours. Okay, right. I forgot to move you guys as well, didn't I? I must be knackered by now. Our cunning foe has reached our walls with their siege tower. We must repel the invaders. Okay, so you have the brain of a peanut. Come over there, go. Now! Okay, I need to move out of the way of my own guy shooting me in the face. Let's just check that you guys are on your way. Good, you are. Right, you come up here. And you come up here. Naturally, you guys come over here as well. Come in here. Because this is the last line of defence, apparently. Did not realise that. Citadel's the last one, isn't it? As in the, the final upgrade. It is unwise to praise the day before sunset, but our men are winning the battle and forging a worthy victory. Okay, so the pilgrims are basically all dead, apart from a few. Oh, there's still some life. Ah, damn it! God, I would not like to be these pilgrims. It is unwise to praise the day before the sunset, sunset, but our, our men are winning, winning the battle, battle and forging a worthy victory. Okay, so I've lost 2% for 34% of their army. I'm pretty pleased with that. 
Um, in fact, hold on. You guys, I'm going to waste you if I leave you there. So I'm going to bring you out as well. Well, I'll bring one of you guys out. I'll leave the rest of you guys in there. In fact, no, not my feudal knights because you're the best. Around. Etc. Um, so you guys come out there. No, not you, you. Shame they can't rest and get you know, more effective, as it were. They didn't seem to ever recover stamina. Okay, you know what, charge him. Take him out. They be but crusader foot knights. And you be but cavalry with giant spears and swords. Take him out! <sighs> cavalry charge. Lovely. And back up again. Woohoo! Took about half of them for about four cavalry. That's pretty impressive. That's what happens, man. That's what happens when you leave your infantry facing the wrong way. Or when you construct an army basically all out of infantry. Which is essentially what you've done. I learned that lesson the, the hard way. Never construct an army completely out of infantry. Put down yes, you've got your spears this time. Smash them. Lancers, I should say. Yeah, right, you'd fix a bloody possibility. Oh, why are you still eager? Stop being eager. The battle is in our favor. If we remain true and wholehearted, victory will be ours. Oh, spear militia. Okay, that might actually be a problem. I mean, even though they suck balls, they're actually going to be quite powerful. You're, you're chasing me, that is very, very brave. And take him out. Ba -ba -la. Morons. Okay, um, what can I do with these guys, which isn't hilariously counterproductive. Um, so there are actually quite a few guys getting in there. Okay. Mwah. Um, okay, so the Levy Archers and Wolves, that's good. I should put the other ones up here as well, I may as well. Uh oh, uh oh. No, no, what? I didn't tell you to do that. Oh, you're being chased, right? That's probably why. Oh, what the hell? They're only, sp they're only playing spear measure. Quick, regroup at the church. And charge directly into spearmen. God save us. The enemy have the walls. That's it, turn around. Look to our defense, or all will be lost. Morons. Route, damn it, route. The battle is in our favor. If we remain true and no, okay, wholehearted, victory will be ours. So, you know, if these cavalry were slightly better, then that would have absolutely demolished them. Oh, whoops, I forgot to turn the time limit on. That's kind of annoying. Let's get another Okay, those are Scottish. I thought they were mine for some reason. Don't know why I would think they were mine. Um, okay, you're Crusader Knights. You know what? By the way. Excuse me? Okay, whatever, the Hinetes can survive then. Do I dare? Yeah, why not? Get a cheeky attack in. And now run away. Rather, don't run through them actually, that'd be pretty cool. Ah, you're gonna die anyway. No, I've got a few of them. Got more than I did, than I lost from the cavalry. Okay, you're gonna get caught, aren't you? You know what? Screw it, it's fine. You're dead. Frankish Knights. Okay, right, they're dead. Okay, um, I've lost my two lots of cavalry then, but it did take them a blooming long time. 
Um, is there any way I can put some guys on that? It's kind of stupid. Like, why would you build this? This is not a good idea. They're obviously going to assault from this side, so why don't they allow me to put some guys on this bit of the wall? Because that's pretty much the most important bit. Um, okay, I'll push my, my crossbowmen there. Um. Okay, you're going to get hit by the Crusader, Crusader Knights, aren't you? Uh, I'll try and run around them. Run around them. Haha, -ha, I'm slightly quicker than you. Even though I'm tired. Yeah, there we go. Win. Will they actually get caught? Will they get caught? There's always a the chance I might accidentally let them in. Nah, they're getting stuck. That's good. Use fire. Um, oh, I've got archers. I've got actual archer archers. You guys fit on there? That'd be quite nice. Just put you guys up here instead of my spearmen. Oh, you can hit them from there, apparently. That's pretty cool. Get up on the walls. Well done, guys. You've done well. Killed about a million pilgrims. Yeah, what are you looking at? Ooh, Pavius crossbow militia. What about you guys? You go up on the walls as well. Come sit in the middle bit. You firing? You firing at? Which is just like one of you firing or something. Oh, them. Okay, well, I'm sort of... I'm waiting for my guys to manoeuvre into position, but currently there's not really any action, so I'm just going to wind forward. Oh, you're firing. Who are you firing at? Eh? Uh, okay. Javadin. If I pull you guys off the wall for now. Just getting in the way a bit. And they're running. Oh, I just want to take out the general, really. 
we take him out, then it'll be plain sailing. Oh god, no, no. Oh, I also remember what happened in Ireland when they refused to stop being an idiot. In fact, everybody, except you, because I've already told you what to do. Shoot it. Ah, oh, damn, he still can't shoot him, can he? Oh, okay. Okay, all of you shoot the general's bodyguard. You can throw a javelin. Uh, actually, no, you can also shoot the general's bodyguard. We're being attacked! Yeah. We're being attacked. We're no ladders, what are you doing? Being crazy fools. Ah, the German's bodyguard only has ten men, ten men left. That's always good to see. Okay, now the task is to, well not you, is to take out their, not you, guys with the battering ram. You all have to, no, would you all have to move? No, just you, okay. I mean, because my javelin men will take care of the rest of the, you know, the last enemy, the actual enemy general. Praise to our lord! Our men have slain the enemy general! Now Good. his men will lose heart! And they're out of there. Ah, there we go. Prince Gil Comega. Ah, now it's just a case of whittling down their numbers with my giant bows of doom. Only half the enemy force remains. That's an interesting statistic, considering they only have twenty-nine percent. We under attack, man. Oh, these guys apparently have infinite ammo, that's good. <laughs> I think only a few of them are firing, so that's probably why.
Yeah, not really much to say here, guys, I'm afraid. Just a slow whittling down of their forces. There we go, now they're retreating as well. Damn it, why didn't I put a time limit on this? Whatever. All oh, of Christendom will be awed by the victory we have won here today. So there we go, the unit has healed 14 units, which is good. Uh, they got killed 361. Uh, the archers and obviously did really well. The mailed knights got squished as well, but there's still three left. They came back, they're still alive. Um, and everyone else obviously did tremendous amounts of damage for almost no loss. Javelin men lost two somehow, I don't really know quite know how that worked, maybe they got shot by their own guys, but apart from that, that was about it. So, yeah, I mean, that was just stupidly easy, because of the polarity of being able to exploit the AI. is a beautiful position to ambush. And they're dead. Oh, good. This will be more difficult. The fools lay siege. Let them come. Oh goody. More generals. Oh no, my settlement's been besieged. <gasps> By France? Oh, for crying out loud. What? Oh, way hey, brilliant. So that's one well, that's one fewer uh, besieging armies to take care of. Because they can no longer be 
Yeah, you feel nice. Um, they can no longer be aggressors in a crusade if they're if they've been excommunicated. Um, but yeah, this episode has gone on for absolutely ages, so I'm gonna have to end it here. Um, I will have cut out a lot of that battle because just because of how mind-numbingly dull it was. Um, and I'm gonna actually, I'm just gonna save the game. Save the game. Um, I'm actually going to change the options there. Now there's a camp campaign battle time limit. Because that was horrible. I wish the Scottish had run out of time because that was so dull waiting them for them to get every single blooming ram up meet on the to the door. Oh, they've got they've got siege weapons. That's not good. Um, I will have to go out and harry them because otherwise I will get destroyed. Oh, King Pepin the Brave. He's pretty old. Um, oh, God, he's good. I'm going to have to kill him quite quickly. Uh, anyway, um, I, hang on. Let's just check. Are they allies? Good. They're not allies with anyone because I was worried that if the if they were allies with the Holy Roman oh no actually they're, they're actually at war with them that's good because um, I was worried that if they you know if they were allies then they'd be able to get an a, an extra boost from the Holy Roman, em, Holy Roman Empire but it's all a moot point because uh, they're gonna have three armies and I'm gonna have one so I'm probably gonna get squished so that's not good um, but I can give it my best shot it's about the yeah that's about, about the best I can I can do. So I'm moving up some more guys to aid out, aid out, help out these these three, and I'm probably going to move up this army from here to um, take it back almost immediately, or at least to help defend because the Holy Roman Empire will then have a foothold here, and I'll need to get rid of it. Um, but to be honest, if, once they've taken it, it won't be so bad because the Crusade will have ended. But you know, until then, it's going to be a bit difficult. Anyway, um, thank you for watching this episode of Let's Play Stand Still. Thanks, Kenny McLean. I've been Big Sloon. Make sure to like, comment, favorite, subscribe, whatever, and I will see you in the next one.